I'm standing in front of St. Ignatius of Loyola Secondary School in Oakville, the school where Nicole Hotchkiss goes to, and it is their hope that they will be able to raise this flag at their school and at all Catholic schools right across Halton for Pride Month in June. The only thing standing in their way is permission from the Halton Catholic District School Board. Nicole is the inspiration behind a motion that will be presented to the board this week. So I was able to speak with them earlier to get into more detail as to how this all came about. Let's have a look. So this originally started as a social justice culminating project where we picked an issue that was important to us and we had to make an actionable plan. And it was our choice if we wanted to follow through with that in real life or if we just kept it as an assignment. And my teachers and classmates and family and friends all encouraged me to take it that one step further. So I delegated on April 6th and they accepted it as information, but two trustees reached out and said they wanted to create a motion to actually try and get this passed. So it was sort of just driven from my own want to pursue this further and see it through. So that's very interesting uh, to me because, you know, here you are, we are in, in the Catholic board. And of course, there are a lot of history behind, you know, LGBTQ plus and, um, you know, Catholicism in this religion. But yeah, you had people, supporters, your own teachers and other schoolmates in this uh, school district that is encouraging you to move forward. Doesn't that show, does that show to you that there is, uh, is a want for change and acceptance and inclusion? Absolutely. Our school has been doing a really, really great job this year specifically um, with LGBTQ plus inclusion at our school. We have an equity and inclusion committee. We have an ally club. Um, we recently had an anti-bullying week specifically focused on LGBTQ plus people. Um, so there's definitely a want within our own school and our school would approve it. My vice principal has signed the petition that's been going around. Um, there has been a lot of support internally, but it's more just that the board won't let this pass. So we're hoping that this motion will give our school the permission to fly the flag like we want to. Really quickly, you talk about this petition. You did send this out. You wanted obviously something to back up uh, this motion as well presenting and you're seeing this a lot of support. So talk about this petition a little bit. Um, so after I had delegated on April 6th, I received a lot of messages from students who were watching or delegating themselves saying, how happy they were that somebody was speaking out about this, either they were an ally or part of the community themselves. And then a few days later, I found out that a student trustee from the board had created a petition in support of my delegation. Um, so I started spreading it like wildfire to everybody who had reached out to me. And now I think we're over 3,100 signatures. So I'm hoping that that can show the board that there is a lot of support for this issue. And especially since I can't be part of the motion because motions are only presented by trustees, I have to give my support from the sidelines as much as possible. So I'm hoping that this petition can sort of offer that support in a way. What do you think that this would, this will do in terms of um, the relationship between, you know, Catholic boards all over, but in particular to ours and the LGBTQ community within, um, within our Halton Catholic District School Board? The flag is a symbol of community and acceptance, and I feel that by having that in front of Catholic schools, LGBTQ plus students can feel like they are welcomed and accepted within Catholic and religious spaces, which often isn't really seen or talked about. There's sort of this divide between the two groups, um, and that relationship is starting to be fixed within our school. But we want for other people to see this. We want LGBTQ plus citizens of Oakville to see it. We just want allies to see it. We want potential newcomers who are new students moving up to high school to decide if they're going to go public where they feel they'll be accepted and where they already fly pride flags or if they could be accepted within Catholic schools. I just feel like it's visibility is the main issue and that support needs to be visible to people. And it would provide a lot of comfort to students who are in the community to know that our school board is proud to have us as part of the school community. The board meeting is scheduled for Tuesday at 7.30 p.m., which will be live streamed. You can catch that live stream on the Halton Catholic District School Board's YouTube page. Meanwhile, if you want to read more about the petition Nicole was talking about or sign it as well, all you have to do is go to change.org and search supporting 2SLGBTQ plus members of HCDSB.